My name is Matthew and today I get the pleasure of showing you around this 2022 on a 22 registration 911 Carrera 4 GTS Cabriolet. It's the 992.1 variation of this car and quite simply the 4 stands for four wheel drive. It's an all wheel drive version of this car and this generation of GTS is now 480 PS. So these are incredibly powerful sports cars that Porsche now deliver to the UK market. The car itself, one owner from new, a full Porsche main dealer service history with its first service having very recently been completed. And in my opinion, finished in one of my favorite colors. This is Aventurine Green. It is absolutely stunning. Um, and one of the more, I would say, sophisticated GTS colors, but I also think it's very important to note that with the black Turbo S center lock wheels, the sports design pack finished painted in matte black, it really does make this color sort of stand out even more. The car is also fitted with a host of optional extras. So we'll walk you around as many of those as we can. So starting at the front end, as I say, it's a GTS. So that sports design pack is standard on a GTS. So you get this updated front bumper with the slightly different sort of vertical um, split sections for the radiator. It's very, very, very pretty. The extended front splitter here, as I say, painted in matte black, that is a cost option. And then moving up to the headlights, the first big item for me, PDLS Plus with Matrix Beam. This is the most advanced headlight that Porsche fit to the 992 generation car. You've got split fit 20 and 21 inch alloy wheels. These are Porsche's Turbo or Turbo S wheel with the center lock system in the middle of them there. I think it's really important. You can have this car without these wheels, but for me, a 911 GTS is about having the center lock turbo wheels. These cars are because they are GTS is because of that, in my opinion, that is like their signature standout piece. Then come down the driver's side, we'll jump in the car, or we'll open the door and show you into the car. For me, I think this interior is absolutely exquisite. It's so special. So this is Icelandic green leather, and that's on the seats, the bottoms of the door cards, and then on the tops of the door cards, we've got black leather with Icelandic green stitching to contrast it. And what you'll see is, it is such a light hue of green. It's just almost like a, just a gentle tint. And it's absolutely, as I say, it's absolutely exquisite on this car. In here, if you have a quick look, the car is also fitted with blind spot monitoring. So you've got three little dots there. So the lane keep assist or blind spot monitoring system that's in there, which is very, very nice. And then coming around the back of the car, Sports design rear tail light, so it's really pretty, it's all clear, there's no red sections in the rear tail light, as well as the long sort of light bar across the back of the car, that's all clear. And then you've got the Porsche model designation, the 911 Carrera 4 GTS, finished in matte black across the back of the boot there as well. Coming down here, some more of that sports design pack, as you can see here, painted in matte black, again, a cost option. We have the original invoice for this, listing all of the items that were cost options on this car. Porsche's sports, switchable sports exhaust system as well, finished in gloss black there and a really extensive sort of diffuser section on the back of these cars. And that is one thing I will tell you about 992 is they're a much wider, much more aggressive car than their predecessor. Um, and a really, really beautiful thing. You know, when you're up, up close to one of these cars, they're a much, much more impressive car to be close to. Porsche drop lights there on the bottom of the doors. I don't know if you can see that or the camera can pick that up. Really, really nice feature. And then jumping in, we've got aluminium sort of style or aluminium finished matte black um, door entry guards there with the model designation sort of etched into them. And then on the driver's door card here, we've got memory function for the driver's seat. These are 18 way adaptive sports seats. So again, one of the biggest options you can have on this car. All electric mirrors, as you can imagine, folding mirrors as well, electrically folding mirrors as well there, and they're obviously heated and anti-dazzle. And then the Bose surround sound system, a really big feature. Now, one other thing that is really nice about this car is it's fitted with the light design pack, which means you get ambient lighting, but it's very, very difficult for me to show you that whilst we're here in the daylight, but a really lovely feature, and you probably can't even pick it up, but there's little lights in every little cubby hole and section 
they're all configurable through the car's computer. Um, and again, at night, it just makes this a much more luxurious place to sit if you are doing any drives through the night in this car. Keyless go on these modern 992s. I'll just bring that flat six into life. An electric steering column, again, a really lovely cost option. And these multiple multi-function screens in front of me are all configurable. So the right-hand screen is all adjustable using this little wheel on the right-hand side of the steering wheel. And then again, the left-hand screen, if I press this, I can adjust that middle dial there as well. So really, really easy for me to use. And if I pop the uh, headlights into automatic, that sets the matrix beam off. So it means all the lights are always on automatic and the adaptive matrix beam is working as it should. Three-point multifunction GT steering wheel, heated. So heated steering wheel switched on there. And then obviously all the drive functions are down here in this little drive control switch down here, which you can spin and change all the modes of the car. Down there is the cruise control fitted to the car as well. And up top on the top of the dashboard over there on this beautiful extended leather dashboard. Again, that's a lovely cost option is the Sports Chrono Pack Plus and that lovely little clock timer on top of the dashboard there, a very sort of iconic Porsche thing. Coming down into the PCM system, being a 22 model year, it gets the updated Porsche communication management system, a much clearer, faster display, wireless Apple CarPlay on these displays. You have got all of the car assists here, so you can switch on the sports exhaust, you can extend the spoiler, you can change all the chassis settings down here. That can all be done within the screen, but you do have shortcut buttons for that down here on the dashboard as well. And if I go back to the main home page of the screen, this is the updated system and you can see really nicely, whilst you can use Apple CarPlay and all of those things, you do also have like Google's live um, satellite view as well with the maps as well. So it's a really fantastic system. I think if I come back into the car and put it in reverse, reversing camera with forward and rear park sensors, but a really fantastic reverse camera with those guidelines on there. And then again, as I said, as I come down the center of the cockpit here, a switchable sports exhaust button and a manual override for those sports chassis settings that you were looking for. Dual zone climate control sound the center of the dashboard. And again, one really nice thing that I'd like to touch on, that black leather extended there is also on the trims. So this is not just some plastic trim, this has all been finished in extended leather. It's absolutely stunning. And as you come down to this sort of gear tunnel section as well, around where the roof controls are and the heated seat controls are, you've got the contrast color of the main hide in that Icelandic green all around this sort of handbrake section around the back of the gear tunnel. So we've got heated seats as well as we move on and a really smart wind deflector which Porsche sort of perfected in the 991. It's a really fantastic feature as a heated seats for driver and passenger. You've got full leather as opposed to the GTS interior pack which means you get leather on the underside of the dashboard as well. Porsche crest to the seats, a GTS logo to the armrest as well, two USB-C points down there. The car has also got its Porsche tracker. And then last but not least, I'll run the roof because it is a convertible. And very nicely, that wind deflector pops itself away as you run the roof. And another very small but nice feature is all of this A-pillar section, all of this sort of windscreen surround on the inside is also adorned in leather, not in plastic. Or, uh, or the Morzine sort of cloth material that they do use in a lot of 911s. And a lovely black hood, again, to match in with the wheels and the uh, sports design accents bits, including those extended side skirts as well. So it just really ties in the color scheme. I think this car has been finished beautifully or ordered beautifully in this particular specification. So as we said at the beginning, a 17,000 mile 2022 911 GTS Carrera 4 GTS convertible with the balance of its manufacturer's warranty still remaining and just been serviced by Porsche. A really, really wonderful example and probably one of my favorite 992 colors. My name is Matthew. I hope this video has helped. Thanks for watching.